what is going on and welcome back to the channel team acne friends and family if you're not subscribed already make sure you subscribe now let's talk about chlorine and acne because as you guys know I have a does this cause acne series here and I've talked about chlorine before but very shortly and I've had loads of you guys talk to me since then asking me to elaborate on this and, and just talk about it more because a lot of people are into swimming sports or just spend a lot of time in the water as you can see I just got out of the water that's why my hair is all funky but I wanted to go through uh, and, and read some of the literature about chlorine so if you if you're just watching the video you can just listen don't worry about actually looking on the screen if you don't want to um, but there's a lot of different opinions with chlorine and it is one of those things that people People have different results with some people say it's the best thing ever when I started swimming my acne went away some people say I got chlorine zits for the sake of it I want to read through some of people's opinions with and this is just really because I want to prove the point that there are loads of different opinions and I also just kind of want to read you guys some of these opinions because there is some interesting stuff in here so this first site is bustle.com. Never heard of it before. Is chlorine good for your skin? Despite everything you've probably learned, it's possible that chlorine is good for your skin, kinda. It's no secret that chlorine can wreak havoc on your skin and hair. A lot of these websites have no science in them, no actual information, and it's just a lot of, of like hearsay. Blah, balance is key, so too much pool time can actually aggravate acne, but not only prolonged exposure to chlorinated water, but existing acne worse can make additional breakouts. So, see, this is the problem with searching for stuff on the internet is a lot of it's just opinion pieces and completely fluff, like n nothing actually useful in there. Um, this site actually is a little bit more interesting. So they do try to like break down what it would be that would cause you to break out more or less. So many swear by the cleansing and relieving properties that the chemical has on their acne. Granted, its germ killing abilities make it sound like the perfect solution to cleanse your face from the dirt that causes you an endless stream of zits. Particularly, people hope that chlorine would help annihilate the propionibacterium acne uh, which helps fuel breakouts. Okay, so so their opinion on this is that uh, the chlorine could possibly be destroying the bacteria on your face that would cause you to break out. Um, then they also go back and kind of give the other opinion, the other side of the argument, uh, that chlorine dries up your face like no other, and you may feel glowing right after being in the pool, but soon after you may already be experiencing the bothersome flaky scaliness on your face and body. That not, doesn't necessarily mean that you're gonna break out because your face is dry, uh, and I think that's where some of this dissemination of some people it helps, some people it makes worse. When you do have dry skin and you have that flakiness on your skin, it can cause your pores to clog up, which can cause acne. Other people have no issues at all with having extremely dry skin. And then their last point is that they say uh, sensitive skin, people who have sensitive skin will be obviously more prone to being irritated by by the chlorine and then that could cause you to, to break out with acne. I, I guess they're kind of making other points like you could absorb ca uh, chlorine into your organs and bloodstream and that could cause breakouts. Now one of my favorite websites, which I don't know if you guys were alive for Yahoo Answers, there used to be an answering version of Yahoo. People would ask questions and people would just come in and answer if they knew the answer. Now there's this thing called Quora, which I'm sure you guys have already seen. This is where all the questions in the world get answered. So this is much more not bloggers, but just people. So the best answer I can give you is a firm maybe. My older son never had much acne on his face, but had quite a bit on his back. It was better when he swam more, but it was best in the summer when he was swimming outdoors exposed to solar UV. So there's 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 why I wanted to read this, is I want to get some people's opinions. Um, I personally have, I think I've seen improvements in my acne in times that I'm in chlorinated water pretty often, which is not very often in my life. But uh, there, there have been times in the past couple of years where I'll, I'll spend like a week or two going to the jacuzzi every day with my, my, my brother or my friends. Um, and in those times, I have seen an improvement with my acne. What she is saying is that her son who had body acne, which is a very interesting point because a lot of people have body acne, it was improved. And I've heard this actually quite a bit is that body acne, um, at least from the people that I've heard it from, reacts more so than your face does when it comes to like being in salt water, being in the sun, or being in chlorine, in terms that it, it, it can improve it a lot. Okay, this, this lady seems very confident. No, it does not. See a dermatologist. My derma, dermatologist boss prescribes low dose antibiotic tablets. So just basically not answering the question. And then this last one, I wanted to point out this website because a lot of times you're gonna fall into looking for an answer 
and then finding a website that seems like they're giving you an answer and actually as you get to the bottom of the paragraph they're just pitching you a product. So you see this and it's like swimmer's acne. Awesome. Why do swimmers tend to break out? The culprit is chlorine from countless hours in the pool. Okay, cool. This looks like an interesting little article. They might have some science. It sounds like they're directly addressing my concern. Also, this logo up here kind of looks like a scientific uh, study website. So this might be serious. Oh, look, there's a solution found in Dermasport. Dermasport was specifically formulated to remove the problem, chlorine. First, the cleanser is used to wash and rid the face of chlorine, makeup, salt, etc., etc., etc. I don't know. It bothers me when people just like obviously see something to make money off of and they just do. I mean, like literally uh, the point of this product is to remove chlorine from your body, which is already too late because it's you've already been in the pool for like, what, an hour? And, and so that's already soaked in there, man. You don't, I don't know. Anyways, <laughs> just wanted to point out that a lot of people will try to sell you something when you look for these answers. And it looks like there's a lot of different websites, but I think I made my point, which is basically just that chlorine and, and, and acne does not have a strict rule that it follows for every person. That's one thing that you're going to have to try yourself. Now, if it does improve, Maybe uh, if, if, you know, if you're just looking for different types of cardio to do, maybe it looks like going to the pool would fix your cardio and also help your acne a bit. So there's something to keep in mind. And if it makes your acne worse, well maybe try spend a little bit less time in chlorinated water and maybe also test out seawater and see if that's a little bit better. Um, but yeah, always do your due diligence. Always make sure that you read up as much as you can check in with me and if you have questions I'm always happy to answer them but then also remember that the, everything is different for every single person so there's never one answer that f just answers everything so I want to make this video a lot of you guys are asking me for my skincare routine I swear it is coming up this one I wanted to make first but it'll be the next one uh, that will be on the channel I hope you guys enjoyed this if you did make sure you give both big old thumbs up let me know what you thought in the comments below and remember you are not alone you are beautiful and you are a part of Team Active.